Hello there friends, Amanda here, and welcome back to Let's Play to the Moon. Last time we left off, we were about to leave this wonderful high school memory. Activate. How are you guys today? I'm doing great. Um, what is this? I think this is his house. there we're almost to the end John I'm going to school now ma have a nice day Joey my baby boy I'm growing up so fast doesn't like to be called Joey and I'm I remember a little bit why <laughs> I don't know if you guys remember, but I have been through this game before, a long time ago. Ugh. What if he was a girl? Would she still nickname him after his grandpa? It wouldn't be that bad, actually. So it ends in E. Joe E. Julie. Julie. Sounds cute. If it sounds so cute, why don't you marry him? Ah, <laughs> jealous? Oh yes, so jealous. <laughs> I like their banter. Oh, really? I was just wanted to know if I can get on the couch. Can't talk to the man. Various books with smudged titles. Gave me a memory link, although I'm sure the smudged titles just meant that he didn't remember them. Memory enough, though. Ugh, bleh. Not again. A glass bottle of pickled cucumbers. Holy crap. My mind's totally blown. Pickles? <laughs> You're pretty easily impressed. <laughs> you know, some people don't know. They don't realize that pickles are just pickled cucumbers. In fact, I didn't make the connection for longer than should have been. <laughs> um, okay. Well, to be fair... A ticking clock is pretty annoying indeed. And actually ticking. <laughs> Alright. Sorry if I'm laughing a lot. I'm starting to have a little glass of something. Or a bottle of something. Um, uh, that's a soccer ball. Not bad. I'm- oh no wait, I think I have them all. I was looking for more when I didn't need to. Let's do this. Ideal six. Alright, if we do... Hmm. <laughs> no. Let's do this one. Then do... I don't know. This one? <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. I think as I drink a little more, it's gonna get less... I'm gonna be less good at this. Smells like roadkill again. Where are we? Ava? 
What the hell is that? I don't know, we have a lot of blank space. I thought I froze for a second. Weird. I'm guessing that's not snow? His memory is all messed up. I don't remember anything about this game, okay. I think I wouldn't forget something like this. That's his next memory. Yeah, but why is it going Lapita on us? Lapita. I don't know, it's just not linking the memories together for construction. There must be a malfunction within the machine's ADG. Again? I thought the last fix was foolproof for another half a year. I can't believe those idiots in the maintenance department. Look, don't worry. We've already gotten the teenage years saved. We might still be able to do this. Alright, but I ain't telling him about this. As long as we succeed, he doesn't have to know. Well, I guess this is it. There's nothing we can do here. Ready to finalize before activation? Ladies first. It's like a... Storm. But if the storm came down like a fog. What a shame. I was actually looking forward to it. Act 2. Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. Alright. Doing good. Yeah, I'm so excited. <laughs> Back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Whatever the words are. I don't know the rest of the words. Da 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 da. Is that the one with spaghetti? No, it's not the spaghetti one. No, it is spaghetti. <laughs> okay. Um, doctor. Don't disturb them. They might not wake easily. But they need the concentration. So it looks like they have footballs on their heads. Okay, we are back at the house. Oh, this is the beginning. The very, very beginning. When we asked him further permission. And that's all this old fool- Oh, shootles. I didn't read the rest. I pushed the button. <sighs> and that'll have to be enough. Sorry, guys. Uh, that's all that's left to do. Well, all that's left to do is linking your registered desire to go to the moon to your early memories. Okay. Are we gonna have some weird- Like, we have to wait for them to stop talking? Then we'll pull the switch and voila, you'll be on the moon in no time. Yeah, are they gonna leave and I'm gonna come back? It's like some weird time loop. I... wait, hold on. I have a question. If you could make Lily disappear, that means you can alter this world. Then, can you not simply make things happen, and fulfill my wish here, now? That would work if this were one of your tr if this were your one true set of memories. What do you mean? What is this then? What am I? This is just a copy. Canver a canvas for us to work with, if you will. As for you, 
You are merely an algorithm traced from Johnny. That's some Soma things going on. Person that's not really you, but you feel like you're you. What makes a person a person type of thing? Enough to reflect his likeness, but far from complete. All we can do is prepare this canvas in a logically consistent way. And then, when we transfer your registered desire to your childhood, the machine will generate your new life, one where the desire dictates your behavior. The rest of that would then be written to the real John. So, you see, even if we satisfy you, you are merely a read-only program. I mean, we could reset you over and over again, and that's enough. Oh, don't be so sensitive. He's not real, you know. But he thinks he's real. If you truly believe that, why did you even care to explain? I'm just trying to save time. Let's go. Um, I thought this was the beginning. He started... I don't know, they were explaining a lot of things that sounded familiar. Doctor, he said. Is that... what I truly am? He's frozen. And sad. Oh, weird. Right. Another puzzle. Ugh. All of her night's work. Oh, these are all the mementos. Getting younger. All the ones that we saw, alright. And then we got stuck. Whoa. Wait. <laughs> what the? I thought something went wrong again. Yeah, at least give me a warning first. <laughs> what can I say? I like being ahead. <laughs> Oh, okay. I'd ask if that was a pun, but I'm afraid you say yes. <laughs> so let's do let's do this fast. I feel silly enough in this form as is. All we need to do is to pass this desire from the latest memory to the earliest. Okay. Look at me! Woohoo! Okay, puzzle time. Line up two matching mementos to the edges to transfer the res registered desire. Oh, so like this? Got it. And then this would be... Wait, can we... Oh yeah, okay, we can change this, it's right. Like that. Then we need to book. Ah, come on. Hey, Ava, check this out. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Dummy? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> oh, am I, can I move? <laughs> I can move. No, oh, everything's funny. wasn't hard. Unless I'm supposed to connect them all continuously, then that's not good. <coughs> Ding! That's about all the ones we can work with.
Ready to pull the switch? You know me. Always ready. Always ready. All right. Let's go check out what souvenirs he brought back from the moon. Ladies first. Not this time, hun. That's a little too early. Let's enter from a bit further ahead to see the results. Oh, we're still heads, okay. Huh. I guess this part's still the same. Let's check somewhere else. I'll go back. Let's transfer back with John and check the other memories. How do I do that? Oh. This? There we go. Sheesh. The same thing here as well? Usually there's at least some change. Something isn't right. These memories, they feel more than just have ha just having happened again. They are exactly the same. That's impossible. The desire was transferred, was it not? It was. I guess we go back. Okay, this isn't right. How could everything be the same? Let's confirm it. We need his last accessible memory. So we go back. We go to the beginning. Oh no, last accessible memory, not the one that we, not the earliest memory. We're, eh, no. This is the same setting as his real last accessible memory. I'm not too crazy about where this is going. Getting interesting though. Why didn't it change? Was it because of what we said to the fake John? Was it because of the machine? Or was it something else? Johnny? Then he's evil. What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. Deja vu again. My name is Dr. Ava Rosaline, and this is... What? I'm not saying it twice. Dr. Neil Watts. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Now this is what happened in the beginning. Lily? It's, everything's exactly the same. Freeze him too. And that shouldn't have happened because we messed with the memories. He should have had something change, even if it was 
He just really liked space, and he had a room full of space. Well... Wait here. I'll go send the desire signal again. See if there are any changes. It transferred successfully, for sure. Any changes? Not even a hair. How could this be? Even if his desire doesn't work alone, why is there no change at all? Perhaps... Perhaps it just needs some provoking to activate. From his early memories? The earliest we can get to. Let's go. Well, things are turning for the worst. We came back. Johnny's desire to go to the moon might need some stimulation to be brought up, huh? Well then. And now we're gonna really start messing with his memories. What the? This wasn't what they said was playing. Oh well. Do you mind, River? No, I like this one. Alright, let's go then. So we're gonna change a lot of things throughout his life to really push things for him going to the moon. Hopefully that's enough for ignition. Wait, where's Neil? Alright, we are going to stop it there. And thank you guys for watching. This was this has been good. We are starting to get into high gear in this game. Things are happening. His memories we can't get to. Nothing's changing. We gotta solve this mystery, but that'll be till next time. So, thank you guys for watching. I know I said that already, but thank you. I really appreciate it. And if you want to comment on anything, please do. And wait for my next video. See you guys!